gonna talk to you about an amazing topic today and it's about creating raving fans you know what are fans right you know when you go to a um, concert nowadays everybody you know the young people they like all these uh, k-pop idols bds uh, blackpink those are fans but there's another category of fans it's called raving fans these are fans that are really crazy you know they you not know, building raving fans in your network marketing business a lot of people i see the biggest mistake you know what they are just going out there trying to sell their company's products and services they act like as if they are salesmen of the company guys i've been telling this over and over don't be the salesman in your company if you really want to be a salesman go and sell cars sell property sell you know a luxury yacht probably you'll make more money but in network marketing it is not about selling so a lot of people say Gary what do you mean it's not about selling guys ultimately the the reward that you want to get from your network marketing business is freedom it's a great life it's like me you know what what's day today today is a Wednesday at Wednesday morning at 9 30 Malaysia time what is everybody else doing they're getting caught in traffic jams right they're answering to bosses and people that has no business running their life right they're doing things with their minds still at home hoping that they can spend time with their kids especially now because in Malaysia now is school holiday it's like your summer holiday you know a lot of parents are out there working working their butts off for what for peanuts and for something that will never sustain after they have left their job right so they are just like lost so in network marketing you are not really working selling a product for money you are here to build a great life to get freedom and to get that you need a network of distributors in your organization that is continue bringing in the sales even while you are biking like me today right biking having a great look at the look at the beautiful sky look at this beautiful day today right so you want to get this you don't want to be selling a product so coming back to my topic today so what's the best thing to do is you want to create raving fans so ask yourself a question how to create raving fans now I teach this a lot uh, me and my team teach this in our master class in during our training in our organizations training we teach people how to be a, a superstar idol where people look at you and idolize you follow you and do exactly what you do they become your raving fans but today in my very quick session I just want to share with you some ideas you see ask yourself a question you have been a an a fan of somebody before I'm very sure you know you have idolized somebody could it be Michael Jackson if you are like my my age you know like you you've adored Michael Jackson before I used to adore Jackie Chan and 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 uh, What's that guy's name? The uh, Donnie Yen, you know. So, so what is it like to 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 feel as a fan to an idol? Is because when you look at that person, you have a certain respect to that person, and that person has probably done something that you feel it is it is like a role model to you. Is he 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 actually gets your respect? And if you see him, you know, if, if he's just within your arm's length, you just want to go and take a photo with him. You, you, you admire him for his work ethics, you know, his habits, his good habits. Maybe the way he talks, like Jackie Chan, you know, I adored him because literally that guy break all his bones for our entertainment. Can you imagine? Can you imagine a guy wakes up in the morning, thinks nothing about losing his life to make films to make us happy? Come on, I have all respect for that guy. So you must ask your, yourself this question. Today, you want to create raving fans. What have you been doing? What are you doing to make yourself a superstar? What are you doing behind the scene when nobody is watching? What are you, what are you building your muscles, your, your, your character muscles, your facial muscle, your, your physical muscle? What have you been doing? To make people admire you, to make people want to follow you, to make people want to be your raving fans like, oh my God, please, I want to be like that guy. Have you written a book? Have you given some talks? Have you broke some bones? <laughs> have, have you sing a song? Do something, guys. I don't know what's your gift. Now, I know you don't have to be like me. You don't have to be a Gary Gunn. You don't need to. But find out what's exactly great about yourself. Okay, you, everybody is born for that, for that greatness. You have it. 
You have to go and find out what's so great about you and work on that greatness, that gift of yours every single day. And I'm very sure very soon one day somebody will want to be your fan. Somebody will want to follow you. Like in my case now, everywhere I go, I go to America, I go to Europe, I go to all the all the parts in uh, 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 Asia. I've got fans, you know, fans on the internet, on social media, fans in physical, they see me. You know, I still remember while I was walking in the airport of San Diego in America. This was like two years ago, okay? I was walking in the airport, coming out with my trolley, and behind me, I heard a, a Caucasian voice shouted out so loud, Gary Gan! I mean, I was like, when I turn around, it's a fan of mine that is based in San Diego. How cool is that, right? You get somebody from nowhere, it's like I walked out of the airport and somebody shouted, Gary Gan! It's like, and then he offered to pu push my trolley for me, take photos with me, you know, sign, uh, uh, got me to sign my book for him. like. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm not, I, uh, to be very frank, I'm just like you. Whoever you are, you are watching this video, I'm just like you. I started off way below average. I started way below most of y'all. But today, I'm where I am because I built up the gift that is given to me by, by God Almighty, by the universe, by my big boss, alright? So ask yourself this question, are you building your gift? So in your network marketing business, when you build up a network of raving fans, wherever you go, you have raving fans, you will always make it because ultimately you want people to say, hey, whatever that guy is doing, I want to be it. Whatever that guy is promoting, I want that part of it. Whatever, wherever that guy goes, I want to go with that person. Whatever country that guy is open, I want to be there. When you have network like that, when you have people wanting to do that with you, I tell you, the world is your playground. Just like what my mentor used to tell me, he says, Gary, if you just want to make some money, you know, some money, little, little, some money, sell the products. But if you want to conquer the world, build people, build network, and ultimately build raving fans. Guys, build fans, build, build, build a, a, a army of people that wants to be where you are, do what you do. All right, guys, so I hope today's message reads out loud and clear to you and if you want more clarity in your network marketing business i strongly encourage you to click the link below there's a link there okay order my ebook it's called the seven golden rules of network marketing millionaires it has helped many people all over the world i'm very sure it will also help you too and with this have a great day i see you at the top